Hello everyone. <clears throat> Just doing a Dollar Tree haul and a crystal haul as well. So first at the Dollar Tree, let's see I got some birds which I'm going to use um, uh, with the fairy domain as well. And these are just for the books. I'm just I just bought some of these to help me hold pages and books together. And this is for straining. And so I got some of that. And then I got this for um <clears throat> the I'm gonna make something out of it for uh Beltane. I got a little chair at the dollar store for, um, again, for the fairy house. I bought these for, um, some friends. I'm making a care package. Not a care package, but, you know, a little gift package, too. And they're just little, um, you know, you put the tarts up top, those wax tarts, and then you burn them, and yeah. I'm sure most of you know what that is. Oh, I got this for uh, my husband. He likes the scissors. And he also likes these uh, adventure adventures. Um, well, he likes the adventures, so I got uh, Captain America, the Hulk, and of course Iron Man. So, let's see. And I got him a notebook because he wants a notebook. Um, <clears throat> I got some roses for decoration on my, um, or the reef and stuff, so these are my favorite kind of flowers. And then uh, I just got some things to go with them. Oh, these are super cute. I got these for the for my fairies, and they smell like they smell like different types of coffee. But there is this uh, cream one, uh, dark one and uh, a white one and they're glass so I figure when the when I'm done using them then um, I can just use them for my fairies too. So got that. And then got some mock pulse. I'm sure you don't care about that. My husband drinks these rippets so I got hands on that but I went to a different dollar store and they had these big um, jars and I mean they're they're decent. Oh, hold on. I mean good quality for you know the dollar store and. Uh, Oh, I'll figure that out. So, yeah. I got four of those to put my herbs in. I also got this for the bottom of the maypole that I'm making. Um, a lighter. I got this candle for um, Beltane. And this was pretty cool. It's a uh, glow in the dark sand. So I do nails, as you can see, I do my nails. Um, and it comes with the sand that's glow in the dark. Oh, comes with a little thing. So stick and a little bottle. I'm going to actually not use that for that. I'll probably use this for 
and then who doesn't need funnels, right? But yeah, these glow in the dark, so that'd be cool to put them in nails. So I got that. The other thing I found over there, which was pretty cool, were these crystal trees. Grow your own crystal trees. You'll see results in one to two hours. So I thought that was really cool. Got little instructions on there. So I got a couple of those and some for my friends too. Like that. <laughs> So, these are different than these ones. This looks like a Christmas tree. Or pine tree. <laughs> and then there was another different one too. Or actually this was a crystal growing kit and they are, um, what is it? There's the rocks in there right there. And then you can just watch them grow, which is pretty cool, so, uh, there was only one left of these, so I just got what was there, alright, and then these are book, um, you know, when you read your books, you, what are they called, <laughs> jeez, can't even figure out the name of them, But you guys know what I'm talking about. But these are the different ones that I got. I actually got these for my friends. I already have this one. So. Got that for my friends. And then I got some soap. I love this soap. Um, I love these soaps. Yardly. So the oatmeal ones. You can see that it has oatmeal in it. I'll just open it. So you can see in there that it has the oatmeal chunks in there and you could actually feel it when you take a bath and to shower or whatever. And it smells good. Okay, so sorry about that. My camera ran out of memory space. <laughs> okay, so we left off at the soap, juicy pomegranate and mango fusion. I've heard um, you know, good things about soft soap, so I figured I'd try it out and this coconut scrub soft soap so let's see what that's all about too and then there's more of those canisters that I got let's see this is the um, planter bowl that I'm going to Put the maypole in here. And I also got this for Demeter, and it reminded me of her. So, let's see if they can. There we go. So, really pretty. So I got that, and then for my crystal haul, let's see, from, I ordered um, a pendulum off of Facebook from uh, one of the friends on there, and um, I'm not sure if she wanted me to say her name or not, so I'll just leave it out. Um, but with that, she sent some lotus leaf, which I didn't order, and it was very nice of her to send me some. Yeah, so thank you, if you're watching this video. And here is the lapis um, it's really pretty. I don't know if you can see the sparkle in it. It's small, it's a, a really small pendulum, probably the smallest one I have. I ordered another one from her, so I don't know if that one's going to be small too, but you can see how small it is. 
on my hand. But yeah. It is really pretty though. So I got that. And then I also went to the Enchanted Garden, which, or Enchanted Rock Garden, which is a rock store um, near me. Or not really near me, but in Minnesota. <laughs> Um, and I bought, uh, a selenite wand, which is pretty big, so, and it was only, um, $6.50. So, yeah, I love it. I also got, um, this stone I bought for Santa Cima Muerta, and this is an opal from Brazil. If you can see it, but it reminds me of a bone, so that's why I got it. I don't think this camera is doing it justice. I also got, and this was, this was only four dollars and fifty cents. Oh, the um, opal was only two dollars. So this huge chunk was four dollars and fifty cents rose quartz. So I got this. And I also bought some some more um see a little bag quartz and these were a dollar fifty a piece. So pretty good size quartz. And I got I'm just trying to remember the name to this one. I don't know if you can see. I'm going to see if I can get it out. One handed. Okay. It's wrapped because it is a fragile one. But I don't know if you can see all of those little blue crystals and green. Beautiful piece. Beautiful. Usually these are more expensive, but... Let me see if I can find the name. His writing isn't that good. Um, Azu... Azuite? I don't know, it's this one. I'm telling you. But he said it's a rare stone, and usually it's way more expensive than um, what he charged, which was $4.50 for a little piece like this. Um, <clears throat> and he said that they got it for a good price, so that's why he's given it for a good price. Alright, so the other one I got is a uh, ruby... What is this called? It's so bad with names. Yeah, and I don't know what I wrote in here. But, um, it's a rock that has fragments of rubies in it. So. It's really pretty. So. Yep, that's all that she wrote. So yep, those are, that is my haul. And if you have any questions, let me know. If not, have a blessed day and thanks for watching. Bye-bye.